I had to, I couldn't wait any longer. I had to get this video out for you. I mean, I had to film it because the thing I had experienced the other day, hold on, let me make sure this works out. The thing I had experienced the other day, which was pretty scary, I will admit, it's something scary for anybody to go through. I had to, what happened? So, my computer, I have a 2012 or well, mid-2012 MacBook Pro. And before, hold on, let me grab, let me grab you my first MacBook Pro and show it to you. Right here is my, this is, uh, I think, uh, early 2011 MacBook Pro. This is the one that I've had for the longest. And as you see, I have all the stickers on it. I even have my very first sticker that I ever did. I did this by hand and I printed this at work. And like this laptop means so much to me. And I'll say that because I, I'll never forget all the moments that I've spent on this laptop designing. And when I first got it, I still remember the experience. And I need to look in the camera instead of looking at myself in the camera. And so the story I want to get into was I had up upgraded my hard drive to an SSD drive. And my computer was having a, it was just automatically restarting. Like it, I'd be on it and then it would freeze. And then it would restart. And now, and that is called kernel panic. It's something that is built in to, like just using this one as an example, just built in to protect parts of the internals on your laptop. I know MacBooks have it, I'm not sure about others. And it was very frustrating, but thankfully, thankfully, to Reddit, to the internet, and to everybody who has helped me, that I was able to figure out what the issue was. And I want to say, as a creative person, or just anybody in general, you always wanna have a backup of your computer, or have a backup for backup. So, me, the storage that I use, this is a, one terabyte external hard drive from Western Digital. I've had this for so long. Like, look how big this is. They don't make one terabytes this size anymore. But, you know, it works and there is no need for me to get rid of it. And it's not full either. And this right here is one terabyte. And I have, this is what I do my time machine backups on. And what else I have, I have this lacy, rugged 300 gigabytes. I think it, hold on, let me see. I think it's 300 gigabytes or 500, I don't remember. But I wanna say it is very, very important for you to back up your computer. Do not wait until something happens and then you'll lose everything. I would say it's good to use like Dropbox and iCloud all you have to do is just get an external hard drive and you could back up your files to that. There's plenty of programs out there nowadays and I had this trusty backup laptop to have.